Hello everyone and welcome to V-Throttle. So today we have the biggest production engine motorcycle in the world and it's the Triumph Rocket 3 R. So guys here is the motorcycle and with the very first look it looks absolutely amazing everything is in such a good proportion those headlamps now it's a complete LED if you compare it with the previous version there are like huge changes this engine this is a complete new engine now uh, the engine is uh, 2458 cc and it's not just the displacement also they have reduced the size of the engine so that it fits in a smaller chassis now so they have saved almost 40 kilograms on this the bike looks more compact and small however the wheelbase is almost dissimilar the motorcycle has new instrument cluster so now you can use your cell phone and connect with the bluetooth of this system and with that you can use this joystick to control the music on it you have uh, four riding modes as you can see so one is the riders mode in which you can actually turn off the traction control and uh, play with the abs you also have hill hold now this is a crisp looking uh, instrument cluster you also have cruise control here we're not going to use that as of for now the front and the rear tires are from avon these are the avon cobra chrome now the best thing, the clutch on the previous was extremely hard so now they have a good slip assist clutch and this is hydraulic. And now you have Brembo brakes on it and it's not about how the brakes are, what is the configuration of the brakes. It's all about while riding if they are going to stop the motorcycle or not and that is the reason I do not talk about numbers in my videos. Now this bike comes with Showa suspension and these suspensions are adjustable. Even the rear suspension is adjustable and this unit is also from Showa. One of the best thing I liked about this motorcycle is this. How beautifully this was placed. So uh, let's see how it rides on the road and we'll take you to another video. So here we are on the world's biggest production engine motorcycle is the Triumph Rocket 3R <laughs> oh, oh fuck such a confidence inspiring machine this is it doesn't feel like you're riding a 2500 cc engine so much civilized but so aggressive when pushed hard there's an insane amount of torque which is 221 newton meters of torque holy shit <laughs> Ha 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 
feels like a sports bike and the size is insane this is a six speed bike the previous generation was a five speed the torque is 221 newton meters at 4000 rpm and 165 horsepower at 6000 those are just crazy numbers with 291 kilogram dry now there are two models in the international market one is the 3R the Rocket 3R and the other one is Rocket 3 GT now Rocket 3 GT have a front forward foot pegs and a handlebar towards you but this one is much more aggressive but a mid positioned footrest on this one they have changed it completely now it has like two injectors per cylinder and also the exhaust is new this is hydro formed now that's cutting edge technology all included in one big bike here this is a badass motorcycle the major improvement is definitely yes the clutch on the earlier model the clutch was like you were doing the exercise for your wrist but this one oh it's smooth as butter it has an IMU which gives all the readings of the motorcycle to the ECU so it does all the calculation in milliseconds and then it improvises the suspension has been tweaked now it is using Showa front and rear and they are adjustable so you do not have to worry about suspension anymore there is so much of control on this motorcycle now and the engine is extremely smooth it still has that raw grunt and raw power <laughs> the braking is from Brembo and boy it works I'm not scared anymore going into the corners with this thing the seat height on this bike is 773 millimeters but as the seat is a little bit wider uh, my feet just reach the ground but everything aside the numbers aside it is not just the numbers that we have to talk about it is the riding pleasure oh this is so satisfying you can cruise all day long on this bike but for my preference i would like to have the gt handlebars uh, not the footrest footrest is fine this small ride have convinced me enough that if i have the money i'll definitely get this <laughs> i hope you will like this small video this is an amazing piece of engineering if you're looking for a big bad bike go for it Thank you for watching, please like, share and subscribe for more, thank you.